So we're here in Port San Luis Harbor right now, and we are camping on Nobi Point, really nice spot. Anyway, um, we just now came into the port area and they have some really nice showers. They got three uh, showers. Um, the temperature is automatically set on them. They run you a dollar a piece. Really nice showers. They have bathrooms and laundry here. They also have a dump station and fresh potable water so you can fill up your uh, RV if you need to. Really cute. Let me show you the bathrooms. Or not the bathrooms, but let me show you the showers. Basically, here are your showers, quite operated. They're a dollar. So here's the laundromat. They have a change machine in here, which is cool. So we're going to walk over here to the harbor and see what else they have here in the little harbor area. Oh, they have a little cafe here too, which is cool. So here's a little cafe. Stuffed French toast, two-piece French toast. Tamales and eggs, biscuit and gravy. So that's the menu for that. So here's a little menu. Oh, they have cocktails, mimosas, margaritas, Bloody Marys, all kinds of beers, desserts. They offer um, really nice meals, huh? This looks like a full service um, restaurant here. And they have a nice little garden out here <clears throat> for outdoor seating has the beer list and appetizers. Really nice. Good morning. Good morning. So this is called Fat Cat's Cafe. Fat Cat's Cafe in San Luis Harbor. So this is the outside. Me and Ron are gonna stop in here and have a little breakfast this morning and uh, we'll let you know how it tastes. This is a really nicely maintained place. Here we go. Oh wow, look at this old boat over here. It's a US Coast Guard one. Wow, that looks pretty cool. Look at that Coast Guard boat. That's pretty awesome. Now we're getting ready to head on to the Harford Pier. <clears throat> So you have Old Port Fish and Seafood, Old Port Inn Restaurant. Ah, got a few things here. Sport Fishing, Harbor Patrol. They have a restaurant out here too, Ron. Yeah, this is the place where they think they've got the live tanks for fish and crab that you can buy if you want to. And this here is the sport fishing place. If you want to hop on a 
fishing boat, this would be the place to go. It's called Patriot Sport Fishing. <clears throat> It's quite a long pier, huh? Yeah. So the crab pots. So they say this is a working pier, as you can see. You know what's cool about this? This is something that you see more up in Northern California, you know? Around Arcadia and stuff. It's really awesome. Crab traps. Lots of crab traps. <clears throat> the mornings on the coast are so nice because there's no wind. <laughs> the wind usually comes up in the afternoon. What a great morning. People do fish off uh, this pier. They also crab off it for rock crab. Out here you can see um, seals, sea otters. This is really quite a long pier. Okay, so these are the little skiffs that the people use to get to their boats, and there's a long ladder that goes down. It looks like they climb all the way down that ladder to get to their little boats. And then there's an area over here. Look at all the sea lines. Looks like they have their own little pier. Look at that sea liner on top of that float, Ron. I see him. That's what I was showing you. That's a little tiny thing. These seals like to wait for the fish to come in. Listen to them. Here's a cute little place called Mercy's, Port San Luis, open at 11 a.m. They have little outdoor seating. I presume it's open for lunch. Oh, they have clam chowder, sides. Oh, they have quite a few things in here. Clam strips, oysters. So this is the Old Port Inn. And it is a seafood market. They offer live fish, live crab. And uh, let's go in and check it out. This is really cool. Oh wow. Oh, everything's in tanks here too. Look at this, all the tanks. So these are some of the things that they offer. So they have steamed clam, steamed shrimp, shrimp cocktail, steamed mussels, smoked salmon, peppered and candied. Oh wow. Oyster shooters, they have all kinds of good stuff. So you can get fresh fish of all sorts here. As well as um, little delicacies. Let's go check it out. Oh wow, here's all the oysters. Oh, here's all your rock cod. Oh my god, this is fantastic. A whole local salmon for $15.99 a pound. It smells like fresh crab in here. Pellet whelps. <coughs> this must be some sort of shellfish. Okay, so this here is a California king crab locally caught, five ninety nine a pound. Oh wow, look at all the rock crab and dunginess. Oh wow, it's a whole slurp in here. Mm -hmm. 
And then here's rock crab males. Oh, wow. Is there a difference between the rock crab female and male's taste? Same. Same? Oh. Oh, okay. Oh wow, look at all this beautiful food. Yeah, beautiful seafood here. So here's the old Port Inn, and this here is a nice little restaurant. And I bet you anything, this is more for dinner. Oh, actually, they offer uh, dinner, lunch, really nice desserts, a creme brulee, peanut butter coconut mousse. This is a really nice little restaurant here. Prices are comparable for the coast. Oh, they have a chipino a la carte. Nice. Really cute. They even have a little to-go window that has fish and chips, fish taco, chowder, french fries, burritos and tacos, bottled beers. Looks like they have a little bar area in there. Really, really cute. Okay, so we are still working our way up here, all the way to the end of the pier. Here's a little bit more of the restaurant in here. Really cute, cute, cute. <clears throat> Any luck this morning? <laughs> Beautiful morning, it's not windy or anything. It's gorgeous out here. So this is us walking off the harbor. And look at the kayakers out there. So pretty. So calm and pretty. Anyway, me and Ron's going to have breakfast at this little place that we've seen up here by where we're parked. And um, before we even start our day. I'm looking forward to breakfast. Did you shoot pictures of these little boats? I think they're cool. Yeah, kayakers and paddle boarders are out already. It is so calm this morning. There's not one bit of wind. What a beautiful morning for kayaking, paddle boarding, and any other type of water sport you're into. We're here in the little town of Avila. And a um, really cute little town. They've got a... All the kids on this, with their surfboards during surf, surf lessons. I don't know where they're taking all these kids, but they're all carrying their surfboards. <laughs> anyway. Beach is really crowded. This is just a tiny little town, like a couple of blocks long. Look where all these kids are going with the surfboards they it's, got. It's a surf school. Oh, okay. So they're teaching them how to carry their boards? Well, they're done. They're going home. Oh, I see. They have to carry their boards back to the van. Oh, okay. I see. Hold on, Rocky. Got it? Mm -hmm. Come on, Rocky. Come on, Rocky. 
And there's a little restaurant, Blue Moon, over Bala. I'm going to run into this gift shop right here. Wow, that's a huge surf school. A lot of kids. Oh, there's a pier that goes out there, too. Very awesome. Okay, I'm going to run into this gift shop. You know, you don't notice all these little places when you're walking. You don't notice all these little places when you're driving by. So this is the main Avila Beach out here. And this one's located in the town of Avila. Oh, they have a little market up here too. Right up here. Really cute. So there's a little ice cream shop. From California's beautiful coastline, you've been road tracking with Rowan Lowe. If you enjoyed our video, please do subscribe so you'll be notified when we play something new.